I don't know. I think maybe the student body can really relate to you. Um, you know, I'm not, I'm not 6'8", and I don't weigh 250 pounds, and, you know, I think things like that makes it easy for the student body, for the fans, for everybody to really kind of relate to you. It's really the greatest feeling in the world. Like, I have a huge fan base from where I'm from that uh, have actually came out just to watch me be on the sidelines, and they were all rooting for me to play college ball during my senior year, and whenever I came out and told them that I was playing here, everybody was excited and wanted to come out and see me play. I think, I, I feel like fans admire walk-ons because, you know, they have to come in and work hard just like everyone else, but they don't necessarily get the chance to play, you know, um, and whenever it's a chance to get in, you know, it, I think people enjoy that because their hard work is just paying off. My role is to just come in and help my teammates get better, whether it's um, understanding the plays of the other team and um, whenever I get in, just pushing my teammates. It's really amazing. Like, it doesn't matter what your role is on the team, we're all friends. Like. From any given night, I'll have anybody from you know Reggie or Giddy over to you know just Isaiah and Steven and chasing them. You know you've got a support system not only on the court with your teammates but also off the court. You got brothers on and off the court. It's kind of like a, what I like to say. It's, it's great because you know when you're in practice and you're you're playing against them and you're watching them, and then you build off the court relationships with them. You know you want to see them succeed. So with that being said, whenever I see see those guys succeeding on the court. Um, I enjoy that for them, and you just wish the best for them. Yeah, I think that just speaks volume for your culture in your locker room, and, and it speaks volume for Steven and Chase, because teams just don't automatically do that. They understand the sacrifices that both guys make, uh, that they're really good teammates, they're good guys off and on the floor, and, and they see how hard that they pull for them while they're playing, and so obviously they want success for those guys as well. Their week is no different than our guys. I mean, their academic uh, in, in the study hall is, is really good. The, uh, you know, obviously, they go to all the weight room, different things, every film meeting that we do, they're, they're involved in. And so that's a, it's a lot of sacrifice for, for guys that are, that are non-scholarship players. I take pride in that because this is my hometown. And um, hopefully someday when it's my chance to be able to get on the court and um, play, you know, I can just do everything for this city because I love this city and I'm from here. And so with that being said, it would just be an honor.